Some South Bay veterans used to have to drive all the way to La Jolla for health care, but not anymore. A new $27 million center has now opened in Chula Vista, and our Jeff McAdam gives us a look inside. Starting Monday, the roughly 50,000 veterans living in the South Bay will get an upgrade to their local health facility. Certainly the prior location that we had in South Bay was very space limited. Director of the VA Healthcare System in San Diego, Robert Smith, says they've expanded from two mental health consultation rooms to 11 and 11 primary care rooms to 28, which means they'll be able to see roughly three times as many patients. And they've modernized the healthcare experience with the touchscreens in the lobby, the ability to make an appointment online, and the telemedicine option from home, all of it geared toward the younger veterans. So one, one of the things that many people are not aware of is that San Diego is is that part of the, the country that has the largest number of veterans receiving care that have served since the 9-11 attacks. So we have here in San Diego a younger group of veterans um, who have different expectations. I think it's beautiful, absolutely gorgeous. I think it's amazing, so modern. Veterans like Carlos Greising and Angela Garrison getting a sneak peek on Friday. Garrison, who's retired Navy, says in the past she'd have to drive all the way to Mission Valley sometimes for care. The number of female veterans in the military continuing to grow over the past decade, and so have the health centers. The new center here in Chula Vista will now have a private waiting room for women and a new department for women's health. Since I retired, I've had some GYN things done at the VA hospital. I've had surgery. so. And it's been top notch, yeah. It's definitely easy to access women's health care. So, again, not only expanding in size, but also expanding in terms of what they provide in services. And it all starts next week. From Chula Vista, Jeff McAdam, Fox 5 News.